Jangan, Jangan lupa, lupa di like, comment, dan subscribe dan klik tombol lonceng di sini. Belajar bahasa Inggris hanya di LC. LC makes everyone speak. Hello, Sears. Welcome back to um, our video again. And today I have a guest star, and I'm going to ask her to introduce herself. Uh, where is she from, and what is she doing here? Okay, your turn. Yeah, my name is Leah. I'm 21 years old, and I'm from Germany, and I'm working in LC as a volunteer um, for three weeks just. Um, and I'm going into every class and doing the culture crossing project. So I'm showing every class um, about my culture and about my country. And yeah. Yeah. Okay, so she's from Germany. Uh, and now she is in charge, um, working in LCS a volunteer. Volunteer. Uh, so Leah, uh, today maybe I'm going to ask you some question, but it's not about German. It's going to be about English. Um, so we are going to share to the viewers about um, the way you learn English and the step and the tips and tricks or something like that. So my first question, um, as a second language, how did you learn English? Um, so in Germany it starts when you are in elementary school, Okay. so in the last year of elementary school when we are around 10 years old maybe or 9 years old and this is where we learn the basic vocabularies like this is an apple, this is a cucumber and um, also alphabet and the clock in English, mm. that's what I remember. Um, and then we had like a little video game okay. in English that we could play um, after school oh, cool. um, to learn the vocabulary and also the basics of grammar. Okay. Um, and then after oh, okay. um, secondary school, uh, in secondary school, um, yeah, we just had normal English lessons. So mm. our teacher was trying to get mm. us through the grammar and the vocabulary. Oh. We always had vocabulary tests and things like that. Oh, so, okay. Yeah. Okay, so um, she explains in English. So maybe I I'm going to translate a little bit to yeah. Indonesia. The point what were you talking about before? Um, jadi guys, uh, cara Lia belajar bahasa Inggris adalah mereka mulai dari SD. Um, jadi dari SD itu udah diajari bahasa Inggris oleh uh, guru mereka dan juga mereka juga selain belajar di kelas mereka juga punya video game di mana mereka bisa meningkatkan bahasa Inggris mereka selain di uh, kelas mereka juga bisa uh, belajar di rumah dengan menggunakan video game ya yeah. I guess that's the point sometimes it's kind of hard to translate full English in Indonesia okay so um, the next question um, do you have any tips and tricks? How did you learn English? I mean like not from course or school, but you do it by yourself. Yeah, so I think um, what everyone says is you have to watch English movies uh, um, with maybe German or your mother language sub yeah. subtitle. Um, and I could say it helped me a little bit uh, at the beginning, but I think you first have to go to the point where you really understand when native speakers mm. speak because it's always also hard with the accent okay um so i could say what helped me the most was really traveling through a country ah. where they speak english so i've been in australia and at first i came there and i thought my english is all right ah, but okay. then in australia i realized how bad my english actually is <laughs> um yeah and because there's no one to help you there's ah. no uh, other German person that could uh, help you translating what you want to say mm. and that's really the point where you learn English so uh, I would always recommend to people go in a country where you have to speak English and you can't go around of that yeah. and this is where you learn English and after that you can understand the English movies as well yeah, and yeah. everything is easier so okay so yeah okay so guys i'm going to translate a little bit the point what uh she talking about before jadi uh, tips and trick lia untuk belajar bahasa inggris adalah ya banyak orang yang bilang bahwa belajar lewat movie itu efektif tapi menurut dia ya it helps a little bit itu agak ya menolong tapi yang paling apa namanya yang paling di, memberikan impact untuk meningkatkan bahasa inggris kalian adalah dengan travel around the world jadi Kalian bisa mengunjungi negara-negara yang uh, basicnya mereka bahasa mereka adalah bahasa Inggris. Lia udah pernah ke Australia, ya Australia. Dan dia pikir sebelumnya bahwa bahasa Inggrisnya dia itu bagus. Ternyata ketika dia ke Australia, bahasa Inggrisnya ya 
standar dan it helps her a lot. Um, itu sangat menolong dia ketika dia travel ke Australia karena di situ apa kamu menemukan poin di mana uh, kamu nggak bisa bahasa kamu sendiri gitu. Kamu menggunakan har- mau nggak mau harus menggunakan bahasa Inggris ya. Yeah. This what the point. Like like really really you have to use English, right? Yeah. Yeah. And I think also when you stay together with the locals. Ah. So uh, especially in Australia there are a lot of backpackers mm. and they come from all over the world and the English is not perfect. Yeah. So it could be not too good to learn their English because they might make some mistakes. Yeah. But if you stay together with the local families, you learn the real correct English. Mm. Um And most of the time when they realize that you really try to speak English, they'll be very nice to you and help you as well oh, okay. when you get stuck in the sentence. Yeah, so uh, I guess the main, the main point is environment, yeah. right? The informa- environment yeah. helps you a lot. Yeah. So, kalian harus temukan lingkungan di mana kalian menggunakan bahasa Inggris lebih banyak daripada bahasa lokal kalian sendiri. Seperti itu. Kalau emang um, kalian nggak bisa ke luar negeri karena finansial atau something, kamu bisa menemukan uh, lingkungan-lingkungan yang lain seperti kampung Inggris, di mana kamu setiap hari lebih banyak menggunakan bahasa Inggris daripada bahasa lokal kamu, seperti itu. Tapi kalau misalnya kamu punya uang lebih, kamu bisa travel ke negara yang basicnya mereka menggunakan bahasa Inggris, agar mau nggak mau kamu harus pakai bahasa Inggris. Nah, itu yang bisa menolong kamu dalam meningkatkan atau improve your English. That's the point. Okay. Maybe what you also have to say is, I, I mean, When you learn that kind of English mm-hmm. uh, during traveling, you really learn how to speak, and you're not afraid about speaking anymore. Yeah. But you you don't really learn the grammar. So yeah. I can say that I'm really often uh, stuck, get stuck with my grammar. Yeah, so yeah. I think visiting um, a course like yeah. an English course to learn the grammar mm. when you already speak a little bit yeah. would be helpful as well. Yeah. Because I'm just speaking without thinking about. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah. I still, I guess like the main point of language is communication. So yeah, sure. yeah grammar is important as well, but like still speaking is number one for me, yeah. I guess. Uh, I guess the method, but the method that, as you said before, the most effective yeah. method is by traveling the country, yeah. especially for English. Yeah, but what I, um, so our teacher in my last school, um, she always forced us to uh, present in front of the class. And I think that was very helpful as well. So um, for me, learning a language is not just learning vocabulary. It's also that you have to, I don't know, overcome yourself and start speaking in front of people. And we did that in our English lessons very often. Wow. Um, so, yeah. Okay, so I think, yeah, presenting uh, and presenting, presenting fr- in a free way yeah. um, is very helpful as well. Okay. And also, um, Sometimes um, writing uh-huh. is very helpful as well to get a feeling uh, of building the sentences. Yeah. So not just all about speaking, but as well about writing, uh, so okay. that you get a feeling for the language. Okay, so yeah, um, yeah. The last question: um, Why do you want to learn English? Um, I mean, of course, it's uh, the word language. Yeah. So there's so many. Oh, that's the way how people communicate. Mm. I mean, we communicate yeah, in English we communicate because in we English. have different languages. And I think that is very important because I really want to travel the world uh-huh. and I want to uh, get to know as many cultures and people as I can. And of course, I can't learn every language on the earth. So that's why I learned yeah, English. Yeah, right. And um, also, it's a very important language in business as well, I think. So everything becomes more international so that you also in your job have to, uh, has to connect with other people. They speak a different language yeah. and then you communicate in English, which is very important as well. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, jadi alasan kenapa Lia mau belajar bahasa Inggris adalah pertama, ya mungkin semua orang udah tahu ya kalau bahasa Inggris itu adalah bahasa internasional. Maka dari itu mau nggak mau kalau emang kamu mau travel atau kamu mau uh, pergi kemana-mana ya bahasa yang kamu gunakan adalah bahasa Inggris seperti itu. Dan um, sekarang juga like pekerjaan, pendidikan dan semuanya itu membutuhkan bahasa Inggris. Maka dari itu ya yeah, that's really important for you to learn English. Yeah. yeah. And it's a nice language. I yeah, like it's it. a nice language. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. yeah that's cool. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I guess for the end of this video, um, 
I want to ask you because this video is to encourage people to learn English. Uh, you know, like yeah. sometimes people are sh uh, shy, uh, try to speak in English, especially. Yeah, a lot of Indonesians feel the same. So maybe you have a suggestion or advice for them yeah, okay. um, to learn English. Okay. Um, I don't know. I can only speak for myself. So what I, I don't know. I think learning. A language is always very difficult and it's always embarrassing as well. I mean, I had many situations where I was talking to uh, native speakers and they were looking at me in a kind of way like, what are you talking about? I don't <laughs> understand a word. But in the end, this is the way how you learn a language. Mm. And learning a language is so important, especially English. Um, it, I don't know, you will feel so much better when you see how you learn the English and you see your, your own results. Um, and it makes fun in the end, and you don't have to be shy. Um, yeah, it's it's fun and it will help you for the rest of your life, I would say. So, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so guys, that was the interview about learning English from Leah. Um, thank you so much, Leah, for your time. You're welcome. And, okay, so I'll see you I think just that for today. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video, and I hope this video is usable for you um, to help you to learn English and yeah, yeah. see you again. Cheers! Mau belajar bahasa Inggris jadi? Kampung Inggris Elsie